Hey guys, this is Johnny Tech Review. Today I have a quick review for you of your Senio 2.4 GHz mini wireless keyboard. As you can see here, this is everything come in the package. You have the keyboard itself, you have a small little mini USB cable to charge it, and there's a small little user menu. So previously I used two or three of these different products, and yeah, they all pretty much are similar in terms of layout and functionality, and this one is no different. Uh, this one does has a few slightly different uh, things and I do want to point out. Uh, first of all, this touchpad here, the previous one I used was a lot smoother, this has a more rougher surface and uh, over time uh, I think they will become a little bit smoother but uh, in general it has a little bit more sexualized. You have here your scroll controls, you can scroll on a website and stuff like that, it works right here. And as you can see right here, the key itself are also very different. They are laid out in this matte black finish and of course they are also backlit. And I'll show you that here in a minute. When the keys are not backlit, sometimes it's kind of hard to see. Like over here, for example, there's the www and the dot com, but it's really hard to see those keys as you can see here. You have here your navigation button, some shortcut key here, and over here, multimeter key. In the back of this unit, as you can see here on the side, there's this nice little texture groove, kind of give you a f firm grip when you're holding on it, just like this. So, yeah, those are some of the things that are different from the other version. Inside here, you have the battery and also the dongle. As you can see here, here's the dongle, and uh, this here will work for multiple devices. You can use it in Windows, my Android box, Xbox, uh, PS3, those things, they all work with this guy. It's pretty good. You just start, plug this guy in, and it's ready to go in no time. It's pretty simple. Battery here is also uh, works pretty well. It lasts quite a long time, so when I got it, all I had to do was charge it just once. Uh, fully charged in about two and a half, three hours or so, and it lasts over a month. There's a power sw switch right here, on off. And if you do not turn it up, it will automatically go to standby after a while. So that will also save you battery. So to activate the backlit, it's in the user menu and you can see it right here. Function, F6, you can see down and it's kind of blue and kind of give you an idea though. It looks pretty nice. It goes up immediately to say battery. Let me turn the light out here a little bit. Here we go again, you can see. That's what it looks like. This LED here is really bright. But in general, that's what the color look like, and as you can see, though, look pretty nice and pretty easy to use. And so overall, it's a pretty nice little keyboard. Uh, this keyboard works pretty well for my Android box. That's what I use it for the most. And uh, when this guy here, you can have up to 30, 40 feet, and it still works pretty well. I found for the Android box, using this touchpad here is very useful to quickly move around to access stuff, and then typing stuff on here is very quickly instead of navigating to the on-screen keyboard. One thing I'd really appreciate is the company sending a user menu that's included. I have three of these products before and none of them had the user menu so you kind of have to figure out how to use some of the functionality especially for example here is the uh, thing you can change for the sensitivity of the touchpad you can change the DPI you can kind of figure it out from the picture but you don't really know exactly what it's changing to and in this menu here I tell you all those things so for example here I tell you that you can change between 800 and 1000 to 200 DPI and they also tell you that you can change the uh, backlight here by pressing function F6 uh, without you use a menu there's no way you're going to know that it's not even labeled here so you just pretty much conclude my quick review of your Senio wireless keyboard I hope it helped you in your budget decision if you have any questions let me know in the comment below and as always stay tuned for future review thank you <laughs>